I base everything on purely art. I like to approach everything in a very artistic way. My production, my music, I just, you know, want to keep it purely art, you know, in a very unique way. I want to bring a whole lot of uniqueness to art and break the boundaries of art itself. When I started doing music, I used to go to the studios, you know, and um, tell producers what I wanted, but uh, I didn't really get what I wanted from them. So it reached a point where I was like, you know what, just give me the, you know, software, let me go sit down with it. And I sat down with the software for like three years, you know, just like learning the basics and all that. And it's been more than like eight years right now. Sometimes it gets a little bit overwhelming. It's something that I love doing. So it's something that when I drown myself in, I don't find any difficulty. I don't find any pressure, you know, and the fact that I make what I have in mind, you know, sometimes like working with producers can be really, you know, can be really challenging because they don't really get the, you know, the, uh, the kind of art that you want. So like for me, being able to like, you know, get it from my mind into the, you know, into like the music itself, it's something that I, you know, yeah. It's called Moonrise. It's, it's crazy. Man. There's a whole lot of good vibes. I'm trying to be diverse as possible. So I'm trying to like integrate a whole, you know, different genres in it. There's hip hop, we have Afro pop, we have R&B. You know, serve everyone their piece of cake, you understand? I want everyone to get a taste of what they love. You know, growth is gradual and we are growing. We're not yet there in terms of, uh, you know, uh, what the government has to do with us, you know, like policies and all that, you know, our copyright societies and all that, we're still not there, but I feel like we're making progress. In the recent past, I've seen a whole lot of, you know, new artists, but people are like working, you know, people are working and I really, I'm really, really proud of what people are doing. You know, at least we are trying to, you know, break the, um, you know, the dogma that we had. In music, we had a, you know, sort of dogma and people are trying to like break it and, you know, explore a whole lot of things in the industry. We definitely want, want to collaborate with, you know, the OG himself, Nikita. You know, she's doing really well. Karun, there's people out here doing Kuzi, man. You know, a whole lot of people doing great shit out here in the trap industry. Boutros, you know, yeah, Brooklyn boy. Yeah, yeah, I mess with her, man. I mess with her music, yeah. Um, there's a EP coming. Uh, it's probably gonna drop next week. There's really, really dope vibes, you know, for everyone. So make sure like you, you know, head to my channel, like on YouTube, subscribe, you know, hit the bell button. And like, there's a whole lot of good stuff like coming. Uh, not only music, you know, in fashion, I'm also into fashion, trying to like bring up a few things. It's gonna be dope, man. You guys just keep it locked in and yeah, one disappointment for sure. Lyco on YouTube, on Instagram is St. Lyco, S-T dot Lyco, L-Y-Q-O. <laughs>